Hi there, this is Bridget from The Planner Speechy and today I am going to be doing a sticker haul from Plana Hannah. This is my first sticker haul with this shop and I'm very excited. Um, so in all honesty, I did unbox this already. I have gone through it and looked at everything. So this is not like a true reveal because I've actually seen it already, but I just wanted to showcase some of the fun stuff that I got. And I'll start with the journaling kit. So this came with the kit and it's funny because I think this is the journaling kit that's going out of the August orders. That's me, even though um, I'm pretty sure this is the, this was July. So I got a bunch of freebies and really cute stuff. So I'm just gonna pull those first. Um, and because I threw away the plastic, I was like, you know, there's more in here. So is that another one? No, okay. So um, this was the sale freebie. She had a sale and that's why I ordered from her. Um, so I think this is, I'm not sure. It might be Lavender Hollow. It's very shiny. So really cute little stickers here. Um, this is another freebie that I got. Um, it's, this is, I think a Taylor Swift quote, quote, this looks like it's some sort of blue wavy font. Um, really pretty. I got this little vinyl ice cream sticker. Very cute. This looks like a collab with Scribble Prints Co. Um, this is really pretty. I'm not sure what kind of, I think this is pink hollow. Anyway, it's really, really, or maybe this is the Lavender Hollow, because these are different. Uh, it's hard to know, like it doesn't say what it is, so. Um, but you can check it out. So this shop is a foil shop. That's the first thing you need to know. Um, so I got a bunch of things and I'm gonna go through them all right here. The first thing I got was a custom birthday order. So this was really cool and it was, definitely on sale. I chose Pixie Hollow for the foil and then you were allowed to customize the names of the people that you wanted to um, put there. So I have one like for our kitties, um, for my friends, for my friends kids, um, for my nieces. So this was like really cute and I feel like I have to say this font is like not easy to read from every angle but not the font, the foil, but I do think that this will be really fun to use throughout the year in my planner. I got this large name custom order. This is Pixie Rose Gold. This I just thought was so pretty, and I'm going to use this to put my name in my planners. Okay, so then we get into the more fun stuff. Um, so this is called Italian. This is a uh, washi strip and I loved this because it had two different styles the first one was pasta and the second one was pizza and I think what looks like some sort of tiramisu so this is all um this is just gold I I decided to do excuse me I decided to do some like basic foils and this I thought would be fun um so most of these are gonna be underlays. So this is an overlay for the washi. But next I have, this is Jack Frost in ice blue. Um, I don't even have a specific kit for this yet, but I just thought this was so pretty and I wanted to save it for when I use it for um, my icy winter kits. This is gorgeous. This is called Library. I got it unfoiled because I wanted to sort of get to see the design. This is an underlay, but I almost feel like for people who are ambitious, if you wanted to make this as like a full box, you could because of the design elements. Um, I'm not sure how this looks when it's foiled, but I would be really curious to see what a foiled one looks like because I feel like you'd probably lose a lot of the details um, in the foiling. So I just thought this was so cool. So I got two sets of that. 
And then um, next up in a similar vein, I got something called Mansion. I'm gonna use this with my clue kit because I thought this was really fun and would like add a little element. Now remember the, I mean, look at the detail on that. The idea of these are to stick, put stickers on top. Um, so it's gonna lose a lot of the <laughs> design elements that go with it, but I think it's still gonna be fun. Um, so that is Mansion in Unfoiled. This is ABC in uh, Pixie, or no, it's Stars Rainbow. Um, you can see the stars embedded in there, but I got this to go with my back to school kit because I thought it was so cute. So this is ABC um, and Yes, this is just gorgeous. I think this is gonna look so nice with those kits. I also got pastel rainbow in pastel rainbows. <laughs> so this one is called Dorothy. I imagine it's supposed to go with like Wizard of Oz kits, but I thought this was just really cute in general and I wanted to um, use it. Now to go with the Italian kit, I got this, but I did it in black and white because I thought it would be um, just unfoiled. So this one is just called Italy. Um, and I thought it would be really fun. Um, my husband is going to Italy. I'm not because I have to work, but I thought this would be fun to use with the Italy kit that I just printed. And now these are a set. So I got, these are called Speech Bubble. And for the obvious reason, I decided to get these. I just thought they were really pretty, so I got all three in, uh, I got them in all four foils. So this is the hollow foil. This one is silver. This one is gold. And this one is rose gold. So I can really use these with any kit, any time of year. Um, but I just thought these were super pretty and I wanted to um, get one of each. So the next one up is Sunflower. I just thought this is so gorgeous. And it's actually Sunflower 3. There were a bunch of different ones that you could get, but I thought this was just the prettiest. And I got this in gold. I have a bunch of gold sunflower things from Sadie Stickers that I've ordered in the past. And so I wanted to just make sure that I had um, that opportunity here. This one is a fun one. This is called Ice Cream 2 and the foil is cotton candy. Um, this is gonna go with an ice cream kit that I'm going to use a little bit later on for the summer. I just thought this was so cute and so fun and the colors work perfectly. Um, I think this was inspired because I started eating those Johnny Pops in cotton candy flavor and they were so good. And I thought, oh, this will be a really cute foil. And I really like these ombre foils. I think they, they translate really well to foil them. And then my last set of overlays, this is Pixie Lemongrass and the theme is lemons. So because of the pixie element, uh, it's kind of hard to see the actual lemon design. You can see it right there. But so I just thought these were so pretty and I wanted to um, just add a little bit of fun. I've never really used foiled underlays before that weren't just like very boring confetti. And so I thought this would be more fun to do. Now, I don't know if I was supposed to get one of these or if I actually ordered it. I don't think I did. I got an oops bundle. So I'm just gonna go ahead and go through these. I did not order any of these specifically, but I thought these were kind of fun. So first thing I got was um, Pathological People Pleaser. It says Tortured Poets Department. This looks like it's um, an oops for um, a product person. I don't know, again, it's the same, it's some sort of hollow. You can see that the, um, the cut lines are off on these, but um, like the full box should work and everything else, so not a big deal. This uh, looks like um, some kind of flowery, pink font 
It says Bloom and Grow and it's from Laura Marie Plans. And this actually looks just fine. I'm not really sure why this would be included in the oops. Um, these are so cute. These are just red foiled heart headers. And again, they look fine. I don't see anything wrong with this. So I'm not really sure like why that was included. This looks like rainbow um, hollow foil or just maybe it's not even hollow. Maybe it's just rainbow. Really, really pretty. Uh, I'm not a bows person, but everybody seems to love bows. So this was a neat actually. This was um, just an unfoiled black um, self-care um, with different fonts. And I actually have a foil machine. So if I wanted to foil these, I could. Um, but this is really cool. I don't know what, oh, it is tanning. I thought that said tarring. <laughs> I don't, I mean, people get mud facials and all these other weird things. It's like, is tar a thing now? But no, it's tanning. I don't do tanning. Um, and I rarely <laughs> get my hair done. I do my nails at home. I haven't had a facial in four years. Lash appointments are amazing, but I've never had them done. I do get my eyebrows done a lot. Um, and I do my own pedicures, but you know, it doesn't say that I can't use it for like self-care stuff. So I really liked that. Um, this one is called checker heart and it's just a washi overlay. And again, I think like, I guess the heart cutouts are not perfect, but again, this looks like very usable to me. Um, I guess as a shop owner, she has to be very specific on like what she sends out. So I don't know. I thought that was kind of cute. This is Carnival 2 and um, this one is really pretty, but it looks like the printed design did not come out super strong, um, but everything else about it looks really, really cute. Um, so this would be pretty I don't have anything that I could use this for now but this is really pretty um and then I got confetti heart two um this looks like it's uh rainbow again this is just really pretty and you could probably use I mean there's only eight underlays but you know if you wanted to use just like one plus like I think it's still really pretty um, this one is called Easter Two, and it has like little chickens <laughs> or baby chicks. And this just looks like, this to me looks like regular gold. It might be a specific kind of gold that I'm just not seeing, but I think this is regular gold. Um, there's nothing wrong with this. So like, I, that's great. I don't know. Um, this was really exciting to get because this is quotes from Taylor Swift's Red, with red foil, which I would have considered buying for myself for fun, but I just didn't because red is my favorite album. And I really love this. This is great. So I do feel like I could use these anytime um, for sure. And I just thought this was super, super cute. Um, so that was really exciting to find in my Oops bundle. And then the last thing I got here. This is a rose gold just um, confetti header covers and then just some really pretty icons um, that are repeat a couple of times. So um, there's one, two, three, four, five rows twice of rose gold and that's lovely. So for an oops bundle, I thought that was pretty good um, considering that you know you don't know what you're getting now obviously with with these you with the underlays you really need two of them to fill out a whole week but you know when you don't know what you're getting I think it's a little bit more fun and now I have all this great foil that I can play with yeah this is definitely some kind of I feel like it's lavender hollow but it's really really pretty Okay, so that was just the oops bundle, but everything else I had customized and made uh, just for me. So anyway, 
that was a lot longer than I thought it was going to be, but there was a lot to showcase. So if you have any questions about this, please let me know. I am gonna start using these in some of my upcoming plan with me, so you will see them again. But, and actually this week um, through August 4th, um, this shop is doing a 25% off for um, spooky stuff. So like ha think Halloween themed um, foils and underlays. So 25% off is not nothing to sneeze at. Um, just those items are 25% off. Everything else is regular price, but I'm thinking about doing it for some of the kits that I already have that I know I'm going to use. Um, so anyway, uh, I will be doing that, but thank you so much and stay tuned for the next plan with me.